Uh, every day that we've shown up, we've had a purpose and we've had a meaning. We've had a vision of what we want to accomplish. Northwood knows how to put on a show. And in year two of the Austin Brown era, Coach Brown is making things even more interesting. Upping the stakes, scheduling Benton, Houghton, and Central Baton Rouge. As far as the schedule and stuff, we uh, the players never blinked an eye. You know, who the teams are, our motivation for us. We go out and we go beat, you know, some, all these 5 eight teams that we have in this stuff schedule. It'll give us, you know, a face on the map so people know that when we come to town, we come to play ball and you're not just going to run over us. We've had that mentality this whole offseason that we're starting the season off in the playoffs. Last season in the playoffs, the Falcons lost a heartbreaker to Leesville, a game that has stuck with the team all offseason. Very few days that that game don't cross my mind. It kind of just lit a fire in all of us in the offseason. Uh, everybody worked a lot harder. Um, we, you know, we, we want to meet them again this year and, um, you know, to have a different outcome. The, the Leesville game, if we took that real person, then we felt like we should have went farther. This season, the Falcons are going to go farther. It will have to be without all-time leading rusher Terrence Cook. But Cook was very quick and had great vision. We're not replacing him. You can't do that. But we do have Hugh White, who was, he was his backup last year. He was second-team all-district as a backup. In year two of the Austin Brown era, the expectations are sky high, and the Falcons are poised to rise to the occasion. With this 23-23 report, I'm Wesley Boone.